Good evening! This is Pokediz Dad here, coming at you with another episode. If you've liked any of my previous videos, please leave a like, subscribe, a click on the notification bell, and leave a comment in the comment section. Apologies for uh, not filming much lately. Um, you know, as you all know, um, Pokemon card collecting can get a little on the expensive side. And I did uh, put out a lot of videos in uh, very fast succession. I think I had uh, 12 episodes out in about a month's time. Um, you know, I, I might have maybe overdid it a little bit. Um, maybe went a little overzealous. Um, but, you know, it, it's kind of good to spread out the money a little bit and try to get packs when you can. Um, but, you know, I, I, I got into making videos at a very good time, you know, when all these new exciting packs were coming out. Um, as you can see on the uh, screen right now, I have uh, two Champions Pack paths, or uh, rather box sets that I was able to get, the Double V and the Hatteran V. I'm not going to open those today, but I do plan on eventually opening them. Um, I actually haven't been able to find Champions Path at all in any of the stores, except for one store that I went to, which was a GameStop. I was able to find two of the Hatteran V boxes, um, but other than that, I haven't seen Champions Path at all in any of the stores. Um, I, I got these two on eBay, and I was able to pick up the other two that I saw at that GameStop. Um, but yeah, other than that, no, I haven't been able to find them at all. Um, I was able to get a hold of Vivid Voltage, and I was able to get a hold of this um, tin, which I didn't, I didn't even know they, they had out until the day before the tin was supposed to come out. I was at my local GameStop, and they said, oh yeah, you can, you can pre-order one of these tins if you'd like, and I said, oh yeah, no, I didn't, I didn't know these tins were coming out, so I was able to secure one of those. Um, my GameStop didn't get any Vivid Voltage except for the stuff that I pre-ordered. Um, they got one booster pack, and that was it. And I ended up taking that one booster pack as well. Um, but I don't know if it's because of COVID. I don't know what. But my area for Pokemon cards, at least right now, is slim pickings. It's, it's really, really, really hard to find things. I mean, one of the Walmarts that I went to, I mean, they don't even sell Pokemon cards, at least right now. Uh, I went there the other day, and... They had zero Pokemon cards on their shelf at all. I was shocked. Um, so, yeah. And then um, I was able to get very lucky and pick up this um, this Zykin and Zamazenta uh, Ultra Premium Collection Box. I don't know if I'm going to, to open the collection box, but, um, you know... Maybe, maybe I'll open it on, on a future video, but right now I think I'm, I'm going to collect it and I'm going to save it back um, because it is an ultra rare special edition. Um, I just happened to be walking in GameStop one day and um, I asked about different pre-orders. I was asking them about um, the hidden fakes that I heard they were going to be uh, re-releasing and... Um, they said, well, you know, we don't have that on pre-order, but we do see this, uh, you know, ultra premium collector's box. It was, it was $100, you know, so I said, I haven't heard about that one, but it sounds like it's something special, so I'll go ahead and buy it. So, for today's video, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to open up this Elite Trainer Box for Vivid Voltage. You know, if you've seen any of my other videos, I haven't had a lot of luck with elite trainer boxes, but uh, I'm hoping I can get some, uh, you know, good pulls, or at least a good pull from this. Obviously, Pikachu VMAX would be one of the best pulls, or rather the Pikachu VMAX Rainbow Rare, but this set also has an Alakazam, I believe, Togekiss, um, so, you know, it, ha it has a lot of good, uh, good little Pokemon, and it also even has a, uh, just a regular Charizard card. Um, with his trainer. So, well, without further ado, let's go ahead and open up a little Vivid Voltage tonight. You know, I love, love, love the artwork on this box. 
I just love the yellows and the orange. It just pops. So as you, as you guys uh, should know, the Elite Trainer Box has eight of the um, Sword and Shield Vivid Voltage Packs, 65 card sleeves, 45 energy cards, a player's guide to Sword and Shield Vivid Voltage Expansion, a Pokemon Training Card Game Rulebook, a six damage counter dice, one competition legal coin flip die, two acrylic condition markers, a collector's box, which is this, to hold everything in with four dividers, and a code card. So, as you can see, this is the guide to Sword and Shield, uh, Vivid Voltage. It has all the Pokemon cards we can expect. And there's a few different, uh, there's two different Pikachu VMAXs it looks like. There's a regular art Pikachu VMAX and it looks like a full art Pikachu VMAX. I, I was right, there is an Alakazam V. Um, there is a Pikachu V Rainbow Rare, as I said. The Orbital VMAX Rainbow Rare. The Darmanitan VMAX Rainbow Rare. There's a few different Trainer Rainbow Rares. There's a Togekiss Rainbow Rare. And there's a few different um, Gold Cards as well that you can find. And then also, along with this, it looks like there are two different theme decks, which I was able to get a hold of the Charizard theme deck um, when I was at GameStop. I was really surprised that they still had those. And then the Dreadnought trainer deck as well. You know, I've never actually opened one of the um, trainer decks. Um, I haven't decided if I'm going to open that one yet, but I might hold on to it for a little while. So, all right. Let's go ahead and open up the Vivid Voltage Pack. All righty, so... Just like all the other packs, they kind of have a nice little full art going on on the inside. Very nice. We have our packs. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. You know, we have our dice, our acrylic markers, the rule book. Dividers, the all-important Pokemon sleeves, the energy cards, and I will show the code card here soon. Code card for all you out there. All right, let's get go ahead and start opening up some vivid voltage. And I don't know if you guys uh, saw my little play mat that I got, but I got this um, cool little play mat with uh, Pikachus and uh, Charizard, different forms. I thought this was a cute little play mat to get. All right, so without further ado, let's open up some cards. Looks like the only art I don't have is the Orbeetle art. You know, the art on these cards are actually, actually pretty beautiful. You know, eventually I'd also like to get my hands on some of the Japanese version of the cards because Japan usually gets all of these sets before we do, except Vivid Voltage, I believe, is a subset of two different um, 
sets. And let me, there's a subset of two different sets. Um, so let's open some cards. And apologies, sometimes my computer for some reason goes to sleep on me, so sometimes I have to get up and adjust adjust the uh, mouse a little bit. All right. We're gonna, we're gonna try to go through these somewhat quickly. I know I have a tendency to kind of ramble on a little bit. <laughs> I don't want the I don't want this pack opening to go too too long because I know I have a habit of making these card pack openings go fairly long. All right, code card. That should be one, two, three, and four. So one, two, three, four. This should be the card. All right, we start off with an energy. We have Trainer League Staff. We have a Corkorok. We have an Energy Aromic Energy. We have a Clubopus. Skiddo. I know one of my other fellow YouTubers really loves Shove It. A Forest Seed. A Joltic. And a Reverse Holographic Rylu. Oh, wait, there's still one more. A Reverse Holographic Rylu. And a Fortress. I'm going to go ahead and put these on their little sleeves. I'm hoping I at least get one VMAX from this pack, but I know historically, it's not just me, um, the Elite Trainer boxes seem to have really poor pulls for a lot of people too, so yeah, it's not just me. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna save the Pikachu's for last. Hopefully, maybe some good luck. Code card. One, two, three, and four. Water energy. Trainer League Staff, Charmeleon, see I always get Charmeleon or Charmander, but I never seem to be able to pull Charizard unless I buy him myself. <laughs> A Pincurchin, Pineco, or Pinecone as it looks like. A Mudbray, Puccina. A Charmander! You know, it's funny, every time I open these packs, I always seem to get Charmander and Charmeleon in the same pack. Chatot! A Reverse Holographic Rockruff! And a Holographic Dinsey! I do not know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but it's a Holographic. Come on, VMAX cards, let's go! Or even a V card. All right, last. For this pack, I thought I had another one of these somewhere. I guess not. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, okay, yeah. I guess it was three and three. Some, somehow I thought I had four of them. Of this same art. Alrighty. The code card. One, two, three, and four. Ooh, could this be the Pikachu? I don't know, we'll see. We have Electric Energy. S Trainer Sir Chester Bath. The Galarian Stunfisk. The Coding Energy. Whalmer. A Weedle. Beldum. Fanpy. Duskull. Tynamo. This is a reverse holographic and a holographic Genesect. And I haven't decided, but I have two other Elite Trainer boxes of the Vivid Voltage. I don't know if I'm going to open them yet, but eh, we'll see. Or, or I, might, I might collect them. I guess it kind of depends on what I end up pulling from these. And also over the Thanksgiving holiday, I'm going to try to make a determination if I'm going to uh, get some of my cards graded. Um, I really want to get some of them graded. I want to get the process starting, but it's just, it's just to try, you know, it's just about getting the process started first. Okay. There's the code card. One, two, three, and four. We have the Psychic Energy, we have a Romic Energy, Galvantula, Galvantula, it's like Tranchula, it's like Tranch, Tranchula, <laughs> I can't say it, it's Tranchula, a Swallow, a Whopper, Deedany, the Pick-a-Pack, Toodle, Peneco, alright, this is a good card, Reverse Holographic Snorlax, and an Explode, alright, I love that Snorlax card, it's, it's a nice card, and it's a rare, so I got two rare cards in this card pack opening. Having this, little, having this little mat here makes it a little bit easier to slide these cards and open them a little safer. One, two, three, and four. We have the Fighting Energy. We have a Wash Energy. Charmeleon. Pinkerchin. The Sandile. Whalmer. Weedle. Beldum. Fampy, a reverse holographic Galarian Stunkfisk, and a Jolteon. Nice. Two packs back to back with two rare cards in the set. And I got a Stunkfish earlier. Let me 
Let me see if that is... Okay, no, this isn't a rare. It's a uncommon. Ah, I'm sorry, my computer for some reason keeps going to sleep. This is kind of annoying. All right. I like this Jolteon. All right, on to the Pikachu packs. Am I going to get disappointed by another Elite Trainer box? I don't know. One, two, three, and four. We have the Psychic Energy. We have a Rocky Helmet. An Alistair. Meetang. Blitzel. Milsery. Skidoo. Eevee. Trubish. A reverse holographic Dawn Fawn. And, oh yes, a col Colossal V Max card. Very nice pull. Awesome. Wow. I think this is my first V Max pull. All right. It's a very beautiful card. All right, so not not bad with this Elite Trainer box this time around. I at least got a, you know, VMAX out of it, which is one of the highest cards you can get. Wow. This might actually be worth um, getting graded. This is a, the Gigantamax form, I, I believe. Nice. Okay. All right, Pikachu, let's keep going. Code card. One, two, three, and four. We have the Leaf Energy. We have the Trumbeak. Nessa. Crackerock. Dumbskull. Electrike. Pinnaco, a Mudbray, Puccina. Okay, I see something. This is a reverse holographic giraffe rig. Giraffe rig. And, oh yes! A Pikachu V! Very nice! Yes! It's not the VMAX card, but you know, this is still a beautiful card nonetheless. Wow. Alright, got a Pikachu and a Pikachu pack. So far these Pikachu packs are uh, treating us pretty well tonight, I would say. Can I get the Pikachu VMAX for the Rainbow Rare? Eh. I'm a little doubtful, but you never know. Alrighty. Code card. One, two, three, and four. Fire energy. Oh, yes! Fire energy! Right on the spot! This 
Sorry, let me organize these a little bit. A Might Yina. This is a this is a pretty beautiful card. We have Beauty. We have Stone Energy. We have the Whalmer. Tynamo. Execute. Chatot. Clubopus. We have another Girafferig. And we have a Lycan Rock. Okay. Alright, I can't I can't be too disappointed. I I got some pretty good cards out of out of tonight's uh, vivid voltage elite trainer box, so kudos, alright. I'm excited. Alrighty. So the two really good cards we got tonight, we got in back-to-back -back packs. That is the Pikachu V and the Col Colossal V Max. Very nice. I think that's going to wrap up our episode tonight. So without further ado, if you've liked this episode, please leave a like. Subscribe, click on the notification bell, and leave a comment in the comment section. Also, to be notified when future videos are posted. Without further ado, this is Pokedis Dad signing off. Good night!